the urine is temporarily stored in the bladder. There are two sets of circular sphincter muscles in the bladder. They are internal sphincter, external sphincter. When the bladder is filling up with the fluid urine, then both these muscles are contracted, so the exit gets closed. But as the pressure of the urine increases, the walls of the bladder are stretched, which causes the upper sphincter to relax. The lower sphincter is under the control of brain. Thus, the urine can still be inhaled until this muscle is relaxed too. Control of urination is impossible by very young child but is gradually learned. When the urinary bladder is filled with 300 to 400 ml of urine, then the urge for maturation occurs. However, urine can be held in the urinary bladder till it gets filled up to the maximum capacity of 700 to 800 ml. At this situation, the urge becomes painful and at last leads to voluntary maturation. Total amount of urine excreted per day may either increase or decrease depending on the intake of fluids like water and fruit juices. But generally, the total amount of urine excreted per day is about 1.6 to 1.8 liters. Attempt the following questions to check your understanding. Think and discuss. Let us know about the composition of urine. What type of materials are present in it? Urine is a transparent fluid produced by the urinary system. The color of urine is amber due to the presence of urochrome. Composition of normal urine varies based on several factors. For example, if a person takes a rich protein diet, it results in more urea in the urine. This is because the proteins get deaminated in the liver with subsequent urea formation. After heavy intake of food, even sugar can appear in a normal person. If all the other conditions are constant, a large intake of liquids or water-rich food increases the volume of water in the blood. Thus, more urine gets excreted. Urine contains 96% of water 2.5% of organic substances which include urea, uric acid, creatine, creatinine, water-soluble vitamins, hormones, oxalates, etc. 1.5% of inorganic solutes that include sodium, chloride, phosphate, sulfate, magnesium, calcium and iodine. Urine is acidic at the beginning. But on continuance, it becomes alkaline due to the decomposition of urea to 